point five circle. Prepare a pin, a pencil, and a rectangular shaped paper with two small holes, and use them as shown shown on the right to draw a curved line on a notebook. You have to pin it here, and you have to take a pencil here. Uh, you need to draw a circle like this. Okay. If you move one round, it forms a circle. The curved line that forms a circle is called circumference. This total portion is called as circumference. Okay. Let's see the parts of the circle. This this is the center center point of the circle, and the distance from the center to the circumference is called radius. Okay. Arc is part of circumference. For example, this one is arc, and card is line segment that connects two end points of an arc. For for example, this is a card. Diameter is a card that passes through the center. So diameter is two times that of the radius. If from here to here it is radius, from here to here it is also radius, right? So diameter is two times the radius. So that is the relationship between radius and diameter now if you need to draw a uh, circle with with a, with a given radius let's say 3 cm measure 3 cm on the scale like this put a needle at 0 and and pencil at 3 okay now on a notebook place the pointer here and draw the curved shape like a circle okay this point this needle point gives you center of the circle you need to rotate completely for a, for about one one circle sorry one one will revolution then circle will be formed you can make several designs using circles <coughs> which one is the longest a b c d e in the circle on the right which line segment is the longest the one which passes through the center so c is the longest segment line segment or longest chord longest chord is always the diameter If we put uh, three CDs in a box whose length is eighteen centimeter, as shown in the shown on the right, what is the radius of CD? Diameter will be eighteen by three, six centimeter. Radius will be six by two, three centimeters. Okay. Complete exercise ten also. We'll meet in the next class with a new chapter.